With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, welcome to the doubtnet. Now the question is integration under root tan x into one plus tan square x into dx. Now let us consider question number first is i is equal to integration under root tan x into one plus tan square x into dx. Now here we can write 1 plus tan square x is equal to sec square x and if we assume tan x is equal to t so we will convert this given function into most integrable form. So put the value of 1 plus tan square x is equal to sec square x. So we can write i is equal to integration under root tan x into sec square x into dx. Now let us consider tan x is equal to t. Now in the next step differentiate it. So we get differentiation of tan x is what sec square x into dx is equal to dt. Now in the next step we can write i is equal to integration tan x is t. So this is under root t into sec square x into dx is what dt. Now in the next step we know that integration of x to the power n this is formula integration of x to the power n is x to the power n plus 1 upon n plus 1. Now use this formula here. So put n is equal to 1 by 2 here. So we get i is equal to this is what t to the power n plus 1 means 1 by 2 plus 1 upon 1 by 2 plus 1 plus add a integration constant c. Now in the next step i is equal to t to the power 1 by 2 plus 1 is what 3 by 2 upon 3 upon 2 plus c. Now in the next step we can write i is equal to 2 by 3 t to the power 3 by 2 plus c. Now put the value of t in this integration so we get i is equal to 2 by 3 t is what tan x so tan x to the power 3 by 2 plus c. This is our final integration of question number first. Now the question number second is let us consider i is equal to integration f of ax plus b whole to the power n into f dash ax plus b into dx. Now in the next step, here we can see that if we assume f ax plus b is equal to t, so the differentiation of f, f ax plus b is present in the numerator. So let us consider f ax plus b is equal to t. Now differentiate this function, so we get differentiation of f ax plus b with respect to ax plus b that is f dash ax plus b into differentiation of ax plus b with respect to x that is a into dx is equal to dt. Now f dash ax plus b into dx is equal to 1 upon a into dt. Now substitute the value of f ax plus b is equal to t and f dash ax plus b into dx is equal to 1 upon a into dt in the integral. So we get i is equal to integration f dash f ax plus b that is t. So this is t to the power n into f dash ax plus b into dx is what 1 upon a into dt. Now in the next step 1 upon a take outside from the integral because this is constant. We get integration t to the power n into d, dt. Now we know that formula is integration of x to the power n is equal to x to the power n plus 1 upon n plus 1. Use this formula in this question. So in the next step we get i is equal to 1 upon a integration of t to the power n and that is t to the power n plus 1 upon n plus 1 plus add a integration constant c. Now in the next step we know that i is equal to 1 upon a and t is what f a x plus b so put here f a x plus b to the power n plus 1 upon n plus 1 plus c this is our final integration of question number second i hope you guys like it thank you so much for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today